Okay folks, welcome back. This is the first addendum that I'm gonna be doing. Gonna be a couple of them. Just with basic stuff and it's gonna cover all those questions that you've been asking me, some extra features and things about Free Falcon 5. And I just downloaded the Free Falcon 5.1 update. So let's start by going to my computer where you start installed your Free Falcon 5. I did on the C drive. Let me just make this a little bit bigger. And here, Free Falcon 5. So just double click on that, and the first thing is the documents. This is what everybody's been asking me about. The keyboards. Here you have the UK, US, and UK page 2, and the US page 1. So there it is, there's your keyboard with everything that you need to know about your jet. You can zoom it zoom it out you can see all the keys here's the legend of how this works basically the first line is that just the key by itself second line is shift plus the key third line is control by the key alt and then shift and control with the key then shift alt and the key control alt and then shift control alt and the key here you go, that is it, that is page 1 and it has page 2 here it's basically your extended keyboard so there you go, this explains here too how do you do it, what all this means this is how I'll be doing your, your tutorials and if you want to print, you just hit print this is how it's gonna look and boom, you're good to go I already have that printed, so I'm not going to print it again. That's the main thing. Now, this folder had a, another uh, file that has more uh, Adobe format uh, documents, like this one, for example. It has this key. Uh, I haven't looked into the features, but if you want to. And this looks a lot more complicated, I think. So if you just go back to the other one, you'll be just fine. This is uh, if you want to write down what your missions are and all that stuff to make it pretty realistic so you don't forget where you're going. I know the keyboard map, but this is last updated. This one you can see here, the MPO switch is uh, empty. It's just one example. I don't know where the other changes are. If you go back to your Free Falcon 1, you can see here the MPO switch. It's, uh, it has two different things for your screenshot and cycle engine. So you might want to use this one. Let's go back here. Uh, more pit documents. Your pick documents uh, said here Free Falcon Company got in the manual folder. So if you want to go check that out. It's right here, right into you. the first time you enter into the Free Falcon fight. Get all the manuals. This is your companion folder. Here they are. All the good stuff, pretty pictures, everything detailed. How to do everything in Free Falcon 5. So, there. This is how I've been making all those tutorials. A lot of reading just for you guys anyway that was that let's just go back out of here back into the documents and where was I? keyboards, okay I did keyboards uh, pit documents, I did pit documents and sp3, this is where we were alright the keyboard reference let's see what this is it's super pack 3 basically every single key in the game Open, close, canopy, shift, control, key, everything inside the game. So that way you don't have to go through the manual like I did three years ago. So now they have it all nice and easy here. So this it's probably going to help me to make the early tutorials because I was just going page by page looking for the stupid keystrokes. Anywho. Now the next one is Korea take-in list. There you go, all the radio frequencies and take-in channels. 
you can scroll down, there's more, more, and a nice pretty picture of the map with the name. Uh, kind of hard to read. Probably won't look too good if you print it, but I don't know if you want to print that. Main checklist. This is pretty useful stuff right here. All the different checklists. There you go if you want to print that. You also have this one too. But they are in the default cockpit of the F-16 CJ. Anyway, so. Uh, weapon checklist. Uh, this is very important. This is one of the best things that they could ever done. This is laser guided bombs. Arming delay is very important. All a lot of good information here. You might want to print that too. And finally, the uh, ramp start trainer. I just discovered this now, a couple days ago. And it's just basically um, it's just a ramp start and move by itself. It tells you where to hit right there with the green circle. So twice for the electric switch. Here you can see where it's telling you what to do and that is where you're working right now, the left console. So hit your lights and now you trail. You can also uh, disengage the help or activate it if you want to. And it will walk you all the way through a ramp start. It's completely automated, you don't have to do anything, just click on the green circles. So I don't know where they add this, but uh, this is the Falcon 4.0 uh, cockpit. Uh, now throttle to idle. Um, so there it is, if you want to play with it, it's there. It'll take you all the way up. And that's that. So now let's go back here and the last one is the manual. It's just telling you where the manual is located. It's just a nice picture and it's telling you the manual is in the manual folder. And that's it. Let's go back out. And uh, so let's go here to your extras folder. Let's start with the beginning. This is just the logo. If you want to check out the logo, print it, do whatever you want. The next one is, oops, the next one is jewel cases. So this one is uh, just a random pictures of uh, a DVD cover. If you want to print them and put it on the DVD, make a copy, send it to your girlfriend, whatever you want to do. So it has different ones if you want to print them. And here it tells you how to do it. So all these are the directions, how to do the DVD case, see the level and all that good stuff. Alright, now next one, the menu is just uh, numbers, resolution, you don't you can do anything with that anyway. Uh, North Korea Takens, this is the enemies, there you go, you know all their bases and their names. There they are. Uh, let's, what is next? The N2 Cold. This is uh, pretty cool. This is an uh, add-on of this plane.